Hello and welcome back to another video. If you're new to the channel, then my name is Jason, aka Hambawang, and I am in Inner Mongolia. Now, Inner Mongolia is known for riding their horses. Now, I'm in a car that has a lot of horsepower. Listen to this. Now, they've given me the keys. They've given me the keys to this, this beauty. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and sneak off. They're telling, they're telling me, they're telling me I can't drive. Oh, I can feel the power. Listen to that power. Oh God. So this car, it's a McLaren. 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 This is a McLaren. It costs Liang Bai Wan. Two, two million. Look at that. Ah, oh, Renminbi. Liang Bai Wan, Renminbi. Wow, look at it. It's beautiful. But the, that's the owner there. And unfortunately, he won't let me drive it. <laughs> right, so I'm just here with the uh, Dakar Zhongguo 3MEI DBR. They've asked me to sign this because, you know, <laughs> international, world-renowned, famous vlogger. So, yeah, I'm going to put my name right in the middle somewhere here, right? Don't be using my signature to write checks, okay? So this is the, uh, the racetrack. I guess it's kind of like some F1 track huh. f1 if you're watching this you should come to uh inner mongolia start a race here hamilton verstappen come on down desert and each one only takes 10 seconds to plant the tree in look at this jeep I've seen some uh, rough days in the desert there are some of the other machines here that they use. Whoa, look at that one. Okay, so now I'm gonna plant my own tree. I chose this one and I named him Harry. I named the tree Harry. Two hours later. How deep? How deep should I go? Uh, deeper. Okay, I'm, I've only done like one foot. Uh, I'm getting kind of tired. I'm afraid if I keep digging, I might dig to England. I think this is deep enough, right? Um, deeper. Deeper. Three hours later. It's no, it's okay. Not no. Plant the tree in, planting Harry, Harry in his hole. Um, this will be his new home, and we're transforming the desert together. Uh, I should put this back in, right? Mm -hmm. But I have to hold the tree. <laughs> okay. I think I did a good job. Oh, oh, we're supposed to add, we need to add the water. So now we've uh, he's added the water and uh, it's done, everything's done. I wish you farewell, Harry. So, using these uh, methods that you just saw on those machines, they are transforming this desert into a green valley.
Well, hello there. Now, I know what you're thinking. I look like an authentic Mongolian. Yes, that is true. With the hair as well. And I know what you're thinking. I look quite, quite powerful and masculine and very strong. I look like a Mongolian warrior. I know, I know, I know. Now, this is more like it. This is what you think of when you imagine Inner Mongolia. The yurts, the open grassland, the vast prairie of Inner Mongolia. Wow. And I'm wearing the authentic Inner Mongolian clothing of a Mongolian warrior. Because, you know, <laughs> naturally, I'm a, I'm a strong, masculine warrior kind of person. So these clothes suit me. What more can I say, really? Here we have some uh, authentic Mongolian nai cha. Look at that. The special thing about Inner Mongolian nai cha is that they have meat in it. This one is some kind of uh, Mongolian uh, uh, yogurt. And you mix it with the sugar and uh, this one together. And here we have some Inner Mongolian watermelon. And here are some Inner Mongolian tissues. And this, this, would you believe it, this is also an Inner Mongolian table. And that over there is an Inner Mongolian chair. Here is my Inner Mongolian hut. Um, no, actually, I just found out that it's called a yurt. I'm in my Inner Mongolian yurt, complete with air conditioning. <laughs> I would guess that an authentic, true Inner Mongolian yurt doesn't have uh, air conditioning. Anyway, there's my beds. Quite lovely, actually. Let's take a look at the bathroom. Complete with a massive shower and a Western toilet. Who would have known? A Western toilet inside an inner Mongolian yurt and air conditioning. Can you believe it? Let's have a look out the window. Well, you can see them all there. <sighs> Don't mind me, guys. I'm a... Uh... I'm just an inner Mongolian king looking over his grasslands. <sighs> I own as far as the eye can see. <sighs> huh, who would have thought Thomas the Tank Engine right in the middle of inner Mongolia? I thought it was hot in Xi'an, but come on down to Inner Mongolia because it's about 50 degrees. <laughs> no, it's not that high. But anyway, with a lot of sun, what can you do with a lot of sun? You can utilize all that sunshine with these solar panels. Look at this massive solar energy uh, base here. And this produces 710,000 kilowatts of power uh, and in the future they are planning on upping that number to 200 million all from the sunshine just look at this place it is massive I right, can see all the uh, stats there wow look at this I'm walking uh, walking underneath some of the panels now I've never been to Inner Mongolia before and I mean I've already seen quite a few places we started off this video on a racetrack then we're in the grasslands and now we're somewhere in the desert at some solar solar farm I mean it's just so many kind of different 
uh, environments uh, and scenes all to see in this uh, one single province although it is a pretty huge province uh, region sorry autonomous region um, so anyway I'm signing off from the solar farm here uh, in Inner Mongolia but there's more to come next video I'm going deep into the desert we're going to the dunes I'll see you in the next one signing off signing off